Okay folks, let's jump right into the features of this bag. So starting out with the strap, we have this nice inch long elastic cross strap here and uh, this nice leather um, piece of leather that holds it all in place. So when you're wearing this pack, this will be situated, you know, basically right between your shoulder blades. And I've worn this day pack or this chest pack here with a backpack on and I haven't really noticed um, that this is, you know, a huge encumbrance where you can feel it, you know, as you wear it, the backpack, it's not really digging into your back at all. I love it so much. And if you'll notice here, we have two types of uh, straps here. We have these, these adjustable buckles with these tabs of nylon that come out. And so when you're wearing this, you can just reach up on your shoulder and you can tighten or loosen these straps as you need if you're, when you're wearing the bag. And then generally when you first get the bag, you'll just adjust these bottom straps here, which aren't so quickly adjustable, but they stay in place. Um, they, you know, they just really lock in. And so you'll adjust those while it's not on your pack. And then if you need to make any adjustments while it's on, you can use these top quick adjustable ones. Um, also note, generally I just stretch this out and you know, slide my arms and head through. But if you wanted to, you can also unclip this whole thing and you know, clip it in once it's on your body, whatever you prefer, whatever works for you. But we've kept that option available. You can you know, just do the sides, you can do the other side, you can do the top, you can do the bottom, you can do whatever you want because you, we've put buckles on all four corners, which is a great feature. Now, going on to one of the main features of this bag, which I absolutely love, is the bottom. So this is a creation of my own. What I've done is I've taken a piece of plexiglass and I've added some Velcro to it and of course this little clip right here. So what we can do is I'll pull this off and show you what this, um, it's just a simple piece and this really performs two functions for the bag. One, it's a clip that you can access, that you can just clip your rod into. It clips in and out very easily. It's a, you know, one-handed, you can just lock it in and pull it out, it's super great. But what this also does is it adds a little bit more structure to the bottom of the bag. And so, uh, which I find is super helpful because this bag on your chest, as I'll show you in a little bit, opens up kind of like a tray. And having this thick, this nice sturdy bottom is super helpful. And so for everyone who is part of our pre-orders, they'll actually get one of these for free. Um, but after our pre-orders, these are gonna be available um, for an additional purchase. Now, um, what I'd like to show you is if you actually decide not to purchase one of those clips, that's no problem. That's why we've put these buckles here on the bottom of the bag. So you can still hold the rod, you can cinch it down like this, and it will still hold the rod in place, right? Not going anywhere. And um, so if you decide not to purchase these, uh, you can still hold the rod on the bottom of the bag. And I think that's very important because I've seen other Tinkara bags where they have the rod situated like this. And especially if you're not using a tiny Tinkara rod, you've got this, you know, 26 long, 26 inch, inch long collapsed Tinkara pole. And if you're wearing on a chest rig, it's, you know, this pole is now sticking up in your face, which I don't think is that great. So that's why we've orientated, um, you know, this bag where it holds the rod along the bottom of the bag like this. And even with the tiny tent too, it just sticks out a little bit on the side. And, and um, it really doesn't, you know, get in the way of your swinging your arms when you're walking at all. And especially with our original tiny ten, which actually fits right inside this bag like that. Isn't that amazing? Uh, you know, it even fits more perfectly. It doesn't even hang out at all, which is, look how streamlined that is. That's great. And then going to the front of the bag, what we've got here is this uh, front zippered compartment, which is great for grabbing things that you need uh, throughout your flight, you know, throughout your day. So I'll, what I put in here is I'll keep uh, some floating, I'll keep um, my tippet in here, just things that I'm often reaching for, I can keep in this front zippered pouch, which is super easy to access. Um, next, we've got our embroidered logo patch here, which is great, and, and underneath that is this nylon sh um, strap or cord with this um, stay on it. And what we've designed this for is when you buy our uh, foam line holders that come with our accessory pack, you can thread it through like that and then cinch it down. And now this is locked in place and you have a great place to hold your foam line holders because before this I was just throwing these in my pocket um, you know, and, it, and it, you know, I forget where I put them and you always need these at the end of the day when you're wrapping up. And so it's great that it's there, you always will have it. And um, we've even experimented with, you know, when you have the rod in this clip like this, 
what you can do is you can even keep the line attached and it'll just run through here and it'll actually lock down where this won't unravel on you and so you can keep it wound up but still on the rod and I've actually used that a couple of times and haven't had a lot of problems and it just makes it a lot quicker when you need to take down the rod and then take and then extend it back out you can you know you have everything right there now going to the back of the bag we have this nice mesh here this is super cushioned and breathable so it's not gonna it's gonna help mitigate some of that chest sweat as you you know if you're out in the sun fishing all day you get a nice little breathability in there now let's go to the main compartment which is this right here and if you'll notice this zipper unzips the entire bag which I find so helpful because there's nothing like getting in a bag and it doesn't open all the way now you gotta stick your hand down there and rummage around so the great thing about this is where you wear it on your chest it'll look like this and it pops open like basically like a tray like this and so we'll have these foam five fly patches which are included so you've got your flies right there you can see everything that's in the bag um, you know it just makes whatever trying to find anything in this bag super easy because it zips open all the way like this now the only downside to this is you got to make sure when you're done grabbing whatever you're doing in the bag you zip this thing all the way up because I've had a problem where I forget to zip it up after I you know grab whatever I need and I bend over and some stuff will dump out so if you just remember just to zip up the bag when you're done um, no problems at all that's the only one downside is that you know if you leave the bag unzipped you know things are gonna fall out if you bend over so um, but it, it you know it opens up like that and then on the back side we just have two nice pockets here and these enable you to carry you know your level line your wallet you know just adds a little more compartmentalization to this whole thing uh, which is great and that's the bag and it really you know meets all the needs I hand designed this bag um, and worked with a small batch manufacturer out in Maryland to make this so this is you know hits all the features of the bags of a bag that I would want that I was unable to buy on the market and so this bag is also uh, made out of this nice water heavily water resistant rip um, stop nylon fabric and so if you're in precipitation this will keep all your stuff dry inside of course these zippers are not waterproof so you can't dunk this bag in the river and have everything dry but you know it's it's on your chest so unless you're taking big spills into the river you've you know tripped and fallen and have fallen head first into the river you know this will keep all your stuff dry in terms of things raining on it and stuff like that it's you know this is nice water resistant fabric um, you know I really am so excited to offer you guys this bag this is the in my mind the perfect bag for the for tiny tin car there's nothing else um, that could really you know that, that I would have done to this bag that we haven't included and um, I, you know I'm really looking forward to sharing this with you guys and like I said, you know, these, these rod clip holders will be included in the pre-order, but will be available for a separate purchase. So there's our Tiny Tankara chest pack, and uh, it's, you know, so light. It fits so well with this elastic. I mean, it just hugs you. Um, I, I'm, I can't get over how perfect I think this bag is, and I'm so excited to share this with you guys. Alrighty, well, thanks so much, and be sure to click the link uh, just below this video to get access to our pre-orders. Okay. Thanks so much for paying it to, for watching you guys and um, you know best of luck out there fishing with the tiny 10 and hopefully soon the tiny 10 chest pack.